Hello friends welcome back to our TS Info YouTube channel this is Ganesh Yadav in this video we are going to discuss how to create collection in power apps when working with the power apps we usually need to create a collection to store and manipulate data within the app temporarily a collection is a group of items or an array a power apps collection is an array that helps to store the data in power apps memory later you can use this stored data in many ways also we can add different data sources like excel spreadsheet or sharepoint online list can be saved in the power apps collection you should remember by default 500 rows are maximum number that can be implemented in a collection simultaneously you can increase the delegation limit to 2000 by increasing the delegation limit to create a power apps collection you should follow these two types of syntaxes like collect function another one is clear collect function The power apps collect function creates a new records in the collection or updating existing collection records repeatedly within the same names. Here you can see the syntax of the collection is collect collection name records. Here the collection function is helps to add a records to a data source and you need to specify a collection name while creating the power apps collection. The record we can take as a single value an item or a table. Similarly the power apps clear collect function creates a new collection add data from the data source or other collections and clears the existing data from the collection the syntax of the clear collect function is clear collect collection name records here clear collect function used to deletes all the records from a collection and then adds a different set of records to the same collection Next I will show you practically how to create a collection using different ways. First of all whenever you want to create a blank canvas app just click on the create button. Here select blank app then choose blank canvas app then click on the create button here provide the app name. Then choose the format like tablet or phone then click on the create button. rename the default screen like collection screen first of all i will show you how to create a power apps collection manually for that select the app object from the left navigation then select the on start property here you can create the collection like here you can see book collection is my collection name book name author are the collection headers or columns and these are the collection items and one more thing you should remember that whenever you create a collection just click on the run on start property to get the created collection and if you want to see the created collection just go to the variable section here expand the collection and here choose the view table option you can see here the specific collection will appear with the all records Next I will show you how to create a collection using button control. For that go to the default screen. Here you can add some controls like text labels and respective text inputs and a button control. For that expand the insert tab. Here search the text label. To change the text property like and similarly add another text label now insert a respective text input controls make the default property as blank and add hint text like uh, similarly add a another text input control for password you need to change the mode property like single line text to password next insert a button control and change the button text like and rename the control names Now set the button control on select property like Here you can see this is my collection name like collection user details these two are my text input controls 
and once your updates are done just save and publish the app then go to the preview section here provide the user details and click on the create collection button to get the collection now to view the collection just go to the variable section here select the respective collection and select view table here you can see the new item has been displayed in the collection like this finally i will show you how to create a collection from a table that means you can connect the data source like sharepoint list excel sql table etc to the collection now i will show you how to create a collection using my sharepoint online list here you can see this is my sharepoint online list like mobile orders inside this i have added some data using different columns now i will add this sharepoint online list to the collection for that go to the power apps and you should remember if you want to connect the sharepoint online list to the power apps just go to the data section here select the add data and search sharepoint select your respective sharepoint online site then choose your respective sharepoint online list like mobile orders then click on the connect button as i told if you want to create a collection you can use power apps on start property or button control or else you can use on visible property of a screen now insert a another blank screen here set its on visible property like here you can see this is my collection name and this is my sharepoint online list once it is done just save and publish the app and to get the created collection just reload the app once as i told if you want to get the created collection just go to the variable section here select the respective collection like collection mobiles and click on the view table you, you can see here our collection has been created from my sharepoint online list yes friends this is all about how to create a collection using different ways I hope guys you like this video to give you a like and do subscribe our YouTube channel for more free videos on SharePoint online power apps and power automate